Hello Aquarius, welcome to your 15 day reading um, for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So this is going to be, um, we're going to start with the Romans Oracle deck. And by the way, this message is going to find you when it's meant to find you. Um, so we're going to get three cards from the uh, Romans Oracle deck. We're going to check in with your energies and then we're going to spy on your person. So let's see. For my... For my um, Aquarius, please. One more. Okay. All right, so we have worth waiting for. And then, oh my God, there's still worth waiting for. Calling in your soulmate. So maybe some of you guys are waiting for someone. And it says divine timing is at work in your love life. So your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. So someone here is uh, meditating, very prayerful, um, and that will manifest for you according to the cards here. So there may be some there may be a separation for some of you. Uh, maybe you're waiting for a message for someone. You're waiting for a lover to manifest in your life, and you keep you know working on yourself to um, resonate to the energy of receiving. Um, this energy that is the greatest uh, energy of all, which is love. So let's do your tarot here. Um, this is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's get a message for my Aquarius. All right, your current energy, Aquarius, for the next 15 days, current energy, Ooh, two of cups. So I feel like you're, there is um, the feeling of belongingness. So there could be like a forgiveness, a new partnership coming in here. And yeah, you're taking action on a partnership. You're taking action on, uh, you may be a couple here. Um, other things, there could be a forgiveness, you know, things, uh, wanting things to work out, a union, a coming together. So um, this could be. Um, yeah, like taking action on your truth, on your happiness, um, fighting for what is right for you, fighting for what is right for this partnership, for this union to work. Um, let's see what is crowning you. What is crowning you is the Page of Swords. So you could be spying on your person or checking out their social media. Um, you could be really thinking about commitment and making uh, making yourself this open and receiving type of energy. Um, look at the two in, uh, figures here. Their hands are opened up and there are two kids. So this could be a family or you could be committed to this person. But there, this is spying so you could be at a distance with this person. Um, but you're being open to whatever will come and being strong, being solid. You have everything that you need. Um, you both love one another. So let's see what it, what the universe want you to know. What does the universe want you to know, Aquarius? Death card. Okay. So there's going to be a change or a transformation that's going to happen here. This uh, transfer, transformation, this change, is going to bring out in you something that you have never experienced before. Um, other people may not um, may not recognize you after all this. Um, this is you manifesting everything you want in life. So you maybe are changing, you know, to manifest this amazing person, this amazing energy to come into your life with the magician because you have the power in your fingertips. You have the cup, the pentacle, the sword, and the wand. And your energy is limitless with this symbol um, you're combining the power of the divine, your mind, and the earthly resources to manifest what you want here. So what is it in the past that they want to point out for you, Scorpio? What is in the past that they want to point out for you? So there's this four of pentacles and the justice card. Um, you could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Libra. This is also my work from home energy or being homebound or has to stay at home for some reason. 
there's a, there was a decision that needs to be made, a huge one. It could be a legal or some kind of a contract thing. Okay, so however that resonates. But there's an energy of having to balance your life, emotional, financial, physical, everything. So let's see what is the outcome here. What is the outcome, please? So the Four of Pentacles could also mean like you're being closed off because uh, the the pentacle is closed to his chest. So I feel like he's planning on a bigger purchase, a bigger manifestation. All right, so the outcome is victory with the Four of Swords here. So there's going to be a victory, triumph, rewards coming in here for you. People will be happy and you'll be praised upon. Um, but you may go you may go to you may it may it may um result to a vacation of you having the time of day to relax and to manifest whatever it is that you want in your life um meditation just like earlier calling in uh, your soulmate so this could also mean that you whatever it is that you're praying for you will win you will get what you want what you're wishing for there's even like a recognition that's going to come about for it. And let's spy on your person, um, Aquarius. So let's see. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Spy on our person. Please. All right. What is your person's current energy, um, Aquarius? What is your person's current energy? Okay. Wait, so it's coming up with the six of wands. I think it's still the previous energy. Um, what is your person's current energy? Okay, so we have the five of pentacles and the seven of cups. So this person is confused. There's so many things in their mind that they want to accomplish. This could be their dreams and wishes. And they're feeling lost, like they're left out in the cold. Um, but I'm, uh, but they, f they feel like they're not alone in this fight. There are just... Um, path that aren't clear and it's confusing for them so they're maybe in a confused state feeling inadequate let me see what are their thoughts of you what are their thoughts for Aquarius please what are their thoughts for Aquarius okay so they have there's the full card and this talks about uh, taking a leap of faith uh, towards the unknown so they even though they don't know where they're at they're confused they're feeling left out they're going to take the plunge here and be in a committed relationship with you. Um, in a, could be a marriage thing, like a serious relationship here. So what are their plans for, for Aquarius, please? What are their plans for Aquarius? Oops. Okay, we have the seven, I'm mean, sorry, six of cups um, and the king of cups. So you could be dealing with a... A water sign that is reminiscing the past with you so they are in this mental state right now of uh, focusing on the past the memories it, this could pertain to a pet as well loving the love that you give to your pet memories you have together um, blissful memories so I feel like they want to protect that and hold that dear in their heart. So you could be this energy uh, towards them. So they want to protect you and hold you dear in their heart. This could also be um, a communication. This is a Pisces energy that is being affected by the by situations that are not within our control, like uh, Mercury retrograde, things that are just not working for some reason. and that may be affecting how the communication goes between you guys. So thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you next time. Bye for now.